Hi guys, today we are going to find the missing height of a trapezoid when the area is given to us. So yesterday we looked for area of a trapezoid and today we are going to be given the area. We're going to be looking for the height. So luckily we have a formula that we can um, utilize to find the height. So we're going to begin with this example. So they're saying the trapezoid has an area of 59.5 square inches. Find the height. So as you can see, the two bases are 5 inches and 12 inches, and the height is what we are looking for, and we will be using um, this formula right here to find our answer. So the formula tells us to multiply the area by 2. Um, the uppercase A stands for area, as you know, so height equals 2A means 2 times A, or 2 times area, divided by the sum of base 1 and base 2. So you have to divide twice the area of the trapezoid by the sum of base 1 and base 2, which means you add them together. So first step is to uh, substitute in the values that we do know. So in this case, height is what we're looking for. So we don't really fill that in. 2 times a. We have to multiply 59.5 by 2. I will be doing it right here. Two times five is ten. Carry the one. Two times nine is eighteen. Plus one is nineteen. Two times five is ten. Ten plus one is eleven. So we get one nineteen, one hundred nineteen divided by base 1 plus base 2, which is 5 plus 12. So I'm going to add them together. 5 plus 12 gives me 17. So now I have to guess and check to see what my answer would be. Okay, so let's try. Let's try 17 times mm, 5, 6. Let's try 6 first. 6 times 7 is 42. 102. Close but not close enough, right? 17 times 7. This is why we use the guess and check method to see if our answers are correct. 7 times 7 is 49. 7 times 1 is 7 plus 4. 119. All right, there we go. We got the answer. So my answer is seven inches. So that's how you find the height of a trapezoid. All you have to do, multiply the area by two and divide by the sum of base one and base two. So as you can see in this problem, that's exactly what I did. So please make sure you follow it step by step. Um, in your practice problems. Good luck.